the crowning moment for the hangman. I'm Matt Carlins, and this is Just Pro Wrestling News for Monday, November 15th, 2021. This update is brought to you by IndieWrestling.us. AEW. Hangman Page is the new AEW champion. He put away Kenny Omega with a pair of buckshot lariats in the main event of Saturday night's Full Gear pay-per-view. The Young Bucks came down to ringside late in the match, but they never intervened. The number one contender for the AEW Championship is now Brian Danielson. He beat Miro via knockout in the final of the World Championship Eliminator Tournament. Britt Baker beat Ty Conti to retain the AEW Women's Championship. The Lucha Brothers are still the AEW Tag Champs. They beat FTR. CM Punk pinned Eddie Kingston with the go-to-sleep. Punk offered to shake Eddie's hand after the match. Eddie did not accept and just walked away. Jungle Boy, Luchasaurus, and Christian Cage beat Adam Cole and the Young Bucks in a Falls Count Anywhere match. Jungle Boy pinned Matt Jackson after hitting him with a concerto on the entrance ramp. Inner Circle beat the Men of the Year and American Top Team in a Minneapolis street fight. Chris Jericho pinned Dan Lambert after landing a frog splash from the top rope. MJF used his dynamite diamond ring to knock out Darby Allen and then pinned Allen with a side headlock. Cody Rhodes and Pac beat Malachi Black and Andrade El Idolo. Pac pinned Andrade with the Black Arrow. And AEW introduced its newest major signing, former Ring of Honor World Champion Jay Lethal. He quickly set himself up to challenge Sammy Guevara for the TNT Championship on Wednesday night's Dynamite. On the buy-in pre-show, Thunder Rosa and Hikaru Shida beat Nyla Rose and Jamie Hayter. Shida rolled up Rose for the pin. Those two will meet again on Wednesday's Dynamite in a TBS Championship tournament match. New Japan Pro Wrestling. The new Never Openweight Champion in New Japan, Tomohiro Ishii, is also being promoted for Wednesday's Dynamite. Tomohiro Ishii took the Never title from Jay White in the main event of New Japan's Battle in the Valley show in San Jose Saturday night. Also on the show, Will Ospreay pinned Ren Narita with Hidden Blade. Later, Ospreay returned to the ring and pitched a Wrestle Kingdom 16 title match for himself on January 5th. He'll get the winner of the IWGP World Heavyweight Championship match between Shingo Takagi and Kazuchika Okada. That is already set for January 4th in Tokyo Dome. Okada beat Buddy Matthews in Matthews' New Japan debut on Saturday night. Impact World Champion Moose beat Juice Robinson in a non-title match. After the match, Jonah, the former Bronson Reed in WWE, arrived in New Japan and attacked both Robinson and David Finley, who tried to come to Juice's aid. Jonah tweeted Sunday that his agreement with New Japan leaves him open for other bookings in the U.S. Chris Dickinson tweeted early Sunday that he needs, quote, every and all positive vibes in the world right now, end quote, after he was apparently injured during his match at Battle in the Valley. New Japan has pulled Dickinson from today's tapings of New Japan Strong in Riverside, California, but offered no details on his injury. Dickinson was on Saturday night's episode of Strong, where he lost to Minoru Suzuki. The episode featured matches recorded in Philadelphia last month. Rocky Romero and Fred Rosser beat the strong openweight champion Filthy Tom Lawler and Danny Limelight. Lawler was pinned by Rosser. Back in Japan, the Best of the Super Juniors tournament resumes Monday, with junior heavyweight champion El Desperado versus Taiji Ishimori and Hiromu Takahashi versus Sho among the matches. The tournament's opening night on Saturday saw Sho get a win over El Desperado. Tetsuya Naito returned to in-ring action on Sunday. He and Sonata beat Hiroki Goto and Yoshihashi. On the first night of the World Tag League Tournament, Naito pinned Yoshihashi with Destino. New champions were crowned in Pro Wrestling Noah on Saturday. Kano beat Masaki Mochizuki to win the GHC national title. Kano then issued a challenge to GHC heavyweight champion Katsuhiko Nakajima to a double title match. That is now set for Sunday, November 28th. Getting back to Saturday's show, Keiji Muda and Nomichi Marafuji took the GHC tag titles from Keito Kiyomiya and Masakita Miya. Ring of Honor. 
A title change in Ring of Honor over the weekend. The OGK, Matt Taven, and Mike Bennett are the new ROH Tag Team Champions. They dethroned Dragon Lee and Kenny King on Sunday night's Honor for All special on Honor Club. WWE. Fox aired WWE's Tribute to the Troops special on Sunday. Roman Reigns beat Shinsuke Nakamura. Big E beat Dolph Ziggler. And Bianca Belair beat Liv Morgan. As of Sunday night, there's basically nothing announced for tonight's Raw. But that is just pro wrestling news for Monday, November 15th. I'm Matt Carlins. Thank you for listening. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.